here, and with Nurtured Nuggets. I wanted to show you guys a way that you can make um, teethers for your babies who are getting their teeth in and they are wanting to chew on something hard or cold to um, kind of numb and make, and make it feel better on their gums as their teeth are coming in. And so this is something that I used to do all the time when my kids were little growing up. Um, is just make banana bread sticks and so this is what they look like they're just it's just strips of banana bread that are very hard and they could um, just chew on these and it would just create a bunch of gooey mess but it also was something that they didn't choke on and it was something that felt good on their gums and it tasted good and I knew what was in it and I could just make it anytime and have a supply and so um, here's how to do it you just make a loaf of banana bread and I this time I used a small mini loaf and just slice it up into the size that you want for your baby and so for this one um, it just you know makes sense to do it like this place them on a pan like this and um, put them in a very low oven around 200 degrees for a good long time and just check them every now and again I think that these the other day when I made them I um, I put them in for about 30 minutes on one side. I flipped them 30 minutes and then they needed a little bit longer to get good and hard. And um, I think probably they were in a total of about an hour and a half. I just turned the oven off and let them sit in the hot oven to get really good and hard. Now you can take these banana sticks, put them in the freezer, freeze them, and then just pull one out as you need it. The cold will feel good and have a numbing effect on, those, on the gums. Um, this is a good size for a baby's little fist. They can hold on to it. This can be a choking hazard, so you wouldn't want to just give this to a child and then walk away. You always want to stay with them and make sure that they don't break this off. But it's, it's going to take a lot, of, a lot of chewing to get it to the point where it's breaking off. But I don't want to um, miss telling you that, that it can be a choking hazard. So anyways, that's just a, something that you can do while you're at home. I hope that you're getting lots of good baking and cooking in during this time and something that your baby can enjoy.